uh, from there. That's that box. And then we're going to finish this off strong. Uh, we're only at 14 minutes right now. We're doing a lot better than I thought we were going to. Uh, ringside collectibles. I'm kind of lost why this is here now when um, I think I pre-ordered stuff on the Black Friday sale. I got some... Oh, I know what these are. These here are the re-release from the Captain Hook unboxing. I was in a really bad mood uh, when I opened that. They were so beat up. But um, we'll go right here. <laughs> We've got, uh, these are series 20s, I think. Bianca Blair. Um, I'm not crazy about these. I think I still ordered these when I was in my mode of like, I wanted to have all of them. Since I think what really kind of killed it for me is just the Macho Man one not coming out, not being in love with the Randy Orton one, not being able to find the Walmart. Um, shoot, what was it? Uh, the Walmart one was uh, Rey Mysterio and Brock Lesnar. Not being able to, to, to get those because Walmart canceled my pre-order. Um, a lot like they canceled my Funko Pop of Cody Rhodes. <laughs> but um, Bobby Lashley, those two... Not in love with. Um, but then right here, this one saved the series. They also are going to three um, coming out. I'm not saying I'm not going to get any more of these, but definitely completest, I'm out. Um, and the ones that I don't need, need they'll be gone. Um, Kurt Engel, right here. Probably the nicest Kurt Engel figure that I've seen. Two gold medals. You got your Attitude Era um, globe style Wayne Diggle. Um, some hands, some faces, comes with the cry face, but he has his, like, I'm gonna kick your ass face right there. And then we have the rookie, Dan Housen, uh, from Series 13. I'm not sure. If, I think this one was announced first, but the Ringside Collectibles one came out first. Um, so I don't know really which one people are going to consider, um... The rookie, rookie, um, but um, I'm pumped to have this one, and uh, he's on my list of somewhere down the road getting to meet this guy. Um, series 13 came with Sting, Darby Allen, Wardlow, the Butcher, the Blade, and the Chase Bunny. So um, that one right there is just a, a make good, um, and I am in a lot better mood opening them this time. So. Um, Hey, that was the Black Friday Spectacular. Um, we will be seeing uh, a Ringside Collectibles Black Friday unboxing, but I think it's going to be a while because I'm pretty sure I ordered the DX um, Retros. I don't know really what else I got. I ended up getting the CM Punk uh, Supreme uh, from Walmart. Um, I was not wanting to pull the trigger on it because of the fact that so many people got Kenny Omega on accident, and then they had to do a return, which sucks, <laughs> because you, uh, Walmart itself won't take an online order that you're wanting to send back, so you'd have to call, you would have to ship it back, and then hope that when they pull your other one, that that's right, so... I can tell you that they're right now. I don't know where the heck I put it. I think it's in a box somewhere, um, but... And that's it. Ringside Collectibles. Uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin hat from the B Shop was probably my favorite. Pro Wrestling Tees order. And um, WB Shop. First time, long time for a Black Friday on that one. Peace out. Mm -hmm.